Food waste is an often overlooked yet significant environmental issue, which is why we're talking about it for today's sustainability spotlight. Food that ends up in the landfill produces a lot of methane, which is a powerful greenhouse gas. In Canada, most of the food waste occurs upstream at the production level, but changes we make at home can also have a significant impact. Each year in Canada, 2.2 million tons of food is wasted at the household level. This evens out to be about 140 kilograms for the average household or $1,100 per year. This sounds like a big number, but the good news is there are lots of strategies we can use to reduce our own household food waste. The first of which is by carefully planning our groceries. By taking an inventory of what we already have in our fridge and planning our meals for the next week around those things, when we do our groceries, we can buy food that will complement what we already have. Another strategy would be, once you do your groceries, um, bringing the old food up to the front of the fridge and placing the new groceries behind it so that you're reminded of the older food and to use it before it goes bad. When you have leftovers, keeping them in a clear container so you know what's in there and you don't forget them, about them is also a good way to remember to eat your leftovers. For anyone who doesn't like eating leftovers, they can contribute to a large portion of your food waste. One great way to make use of leftovers is by turning the original meal into something completely new. For example, if you had hamburgers for dinner one night and you have a few leftover patties and some onion slices, you can add them to a pan and break apart the patties um, and saute them into a stir fry with some additional fresh veggies like maybe carrots or bell peppers or broccoli. And then you can just add some sauce and serve over rice and you have a whole new meal. Finally, a further way we can reduce our household food waste is through how we prepare our food. Root to leaf eating or peel to pit eating is a way of preparing our food that includes all of the edible parts of the plant. So for example, when preparing radishes or beets, rather than just using the root part, you can also use the leafy greens at the top and add them to a salad or a stir fry. Some other commonly wasted plant parts include cauliflower leaves, stems such as Swiss chard stems, uh, broccoli stems or kale stems, as well as potato skins. Believe it or not, the rind of a watermelon is actually edible too. They, you can pickle a watermelon rind or you can peel off the skin and throw it into a stir fry and it'll behave just like any other vegetable. So as you can see, there are a lot of ways that we can work towards reducing our household food waste. If you're looking for more information or tips and tricks for reducing your household food waste, um, check out the National Zero Waste Council.